Hello, welcome to the account solutions. This is the template for NGOs, non for profit organizations, um, based on the popular demand for us to customize our master cash book to enable NGO organizations, you know, um, have better kind of reporting. We've developed this tool um, to help NGOs maintain proper you know accounting and records so this is the, the cash and bank book entry ledger so after you enter your ledgers you have your cash and bank account you can see we have the bank name the date of transactions the transaction narrations you've entered document number external reference number then the gl code that the money was paid to or received from you can see all the income in debit side of the cash book and all the expenses in the credit of the cash book this is a report from um, your entry that you've made on a day-to-day -day basis you can see uh, we have another account here usd account that have been converted to the, the reporting currency which is in the case naira now we also have the general ledger which shows you all your GL accounts, motor vehicles, transactions, document numbers, the bank or cash account it was paid from, then debit. You can see grant income will show you here. You can see all the transactions in grant income. The account it came to, this came to USD account, Naira account, and the credit amount. This is your GL. Once you enter your data, this GL um, gives you detailed descriptions for your transactions for income and for expenses this is activity or higher cost you can see all your reports day-to-day -day report for that particular period next we have the donor reports so we have different projects that are sponsored by different donors you have the donor name here and all the all the projects sponsored by that donor the return rate income received from that donor, expense budget, actual spend, and variance. You know, see donor name, budget, bond rate, you know, so you have your reports you can share with your donor. Then next we have the project fund account. What happens here is your income and expenditure account. We have all the projects lined up from the first to the last project. And each of them, we have reports for all the GL codes. These are the income codes um, for direct income, cash-based income. Remember, this is a cash book. This is other income, cash-based. So you have your total income for that year. For each of the projects, you know, you have their incomes. So you can actually track income received from this project and your expenses if you go down you see the expenses from that particular project so this total for the entire project of the ngo this is per project as you spend and receive money you have all those reports and if you have items that are not cash you know you want to accrue for some income you can enter them manually here Otherwise, other transactions are automatically picked from your cash book when you post your cash book. You can see all the way down, we have the net um, report based on cash, you know, total cash income over expense, total accrued income over expense, and grand total income over expense. You can see all your reports will populate here. We have another report called Project Plus Month Fund Account. So in this case, you have all the months from the first month to the twelfth month of the year. And you have them here. You now have total reports for that year. Now, if you remove this project here, you will see the entire report for um, the entire project for January up to May as you enter your data we want to see specific projects how the income is coming and expenses is being made just click on any of the projects 
you will see the income for that project and you also see all the expenses for that project if you want to see all the projects cumulatively just delete this and you will see total income and total expenses for all your projects you know, so that is how this report is being run so here is also income and expenditure report showing you total income each month and your total expenditure for each month at the end you have your net you know income over expenditure for that particular month so this is for the whole year this is month by month for the entire ngo if you want to view only the report for one project you have to select the project here and you will view the report for that particular project next we have the cash book itself this is where you enter your day-to-day -day transaction we have the date the account you are, you are paying from or receiving the money to or your bank account or cash account we have the detailed narrations you know in a way that whoever reads the narration will understand what the transaction was meant for we have the internal index the internal index if you have any document number voucher received you can use these two columns to put those numbers now the amount in the transaction currency if it's usd put the usd amount if it's naira put the naira amount so you put the exchange rate if you are converting from your usd to the important currency in this case naira you put the exchange rate but if it is naira to naira put just put one there you now pick your inflow or outflow you now choose the gi code that that is going for for you now choose the project so this is just uh, what you need to do there are about 10 columns you need to fill once you fill that for each transaction it will report against all your other reports you can see here now how the chart of account where we set up your account chart for your GI codes here we also have opportunity to set budget for each year so you have the budget for all these GL codes actual picks from this your cash book and gives you your variance then you also have the actual for each of the months you see the actual based on all these gr codes you can see actual for that particular year now you can see for this actual you can see that um, this is the asset this is the income expenditure this is the aggregate so you can use your total accounts to view your spend report and finally we have the project chart where you set all your projects and the donors it gives you opportunities to key in your uh, income budget and your expense budget and as you make expenses and receive income and post in your cash book here it will update your actual income and update your actual expenses and give you your expense variance now you have your bond rate once it's read it means that you are you have spent above 100 percent of the budget when it is yellow it means you are you have spent about 85 percent and you are approaching 100 percent so be careful not to overspend on your budget now we have month by month expenses for each budget monthly cost of project so we have um, all the months here that you enter data in, in for now at the, each month is being you know as you spend per month you see the progressive bond rate out of january five percent bond rate um february to 30 percent bond rate you see all the bond rates so you know at every point in time where you are in terms of your budget so this sheet helps you to track your budget and again everything that comes here automatic once you post your cash transactions it automatically appears on your project uh, chart and your chart of account you know sheet so the, finally we have it set up you type in your ngo name the date of the accounting period and then you list all your bank accounts so that there you go this is an overview of the templates designed to help NGOs track their cash transactions and also prepare their income and expenditure accounts. In this video, we'll show you a blank sheet how to start setting up and entering the data one by one, and you will see how the report will come out. Thanks for watching. Bye.